So people ask me a lot about how to train for arm wrestling and uh, this is one of the ways to train. Uh, when you're training for arm wrestling, if you're training with a club and if you're prioritizing your table time, which you really should do, getting you know one, two, who knows, maybe even more table sessions in a week, it leaves all your arm wrestling muscles really wrecked. When you're doing arm wrestling training on the table, lots of negatives, all your arm wrestling muscles are going to be getting opened up and really there's very little requirement to train them hard off the table. Uh, the problem is, is what to do in between to uh, help your healing. So a lot of arm wrestlers work out in a very rehabilitative way. And that's what I'm going to show you now. Uh, so, for example, like what I do is I'll work out with anything, whether it's, uh, you know, I go to the gym or you can even work out with just a straight up gym bag. And all I'll do is I'll put either water bottles in it or rocks or if I got weights, I'll use weights. So this is just a style of working out. You could do it with, with any real system, but I'll just kind of show you one way, one way of doing it. So if I'm going to work out with a bag, all I'm trying to do when I'm rehabbing is I'm trying to get blood flow going. I'm trying to get as much blood as I can to my connective tissues. Because so after I pull on the table, all my tendons, my ligaments might have a little bit of inflammation. So I'm just trying to help, you know, smooth all that stuff out, lay down, you know, proper collagen where it wants to be, smooth everything out real good. So I do a lot of reps of 50 with really not challenging weight. So right now there's 10 pounds in this backpack. So I'm going to hit three movements pull, three movements push, and then cup and kick back. And that's going to be one set. So with my right, I'm going to work my rise. So I'm just up, 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 up. And I'll do that 50 times, okay? 50 times. Switch to the left, okay? 50 times, all right? And I just put, put the pack so that uh, this is in between my knuckle and it rise up on my finger. I keep my wrist straight, you know, just like how I'd be at the table, getting that post in. Uh, this, is, this is not, you know, a challenging amount of weight at all, okay? At no point do I feel pain at the end of the 50, I might feel a little bit of burn, but it's really all about just getting the blood flow in. Okay, so 50, 50. Then I'm going to change to, uh, you know, pulling upwards with pronation. Okay, so same kind of thing. Twist, 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 twist. Same thing, left hand. Twist. And uh, these exercises are not as specific as some arm wrestling exercises you've seen. But really, it's not so much about that. It's really just about stimulating the blood flow and the convenience of doing it. Okay, so that's first one up, straight up post. Next one with pronation. The next one uh, with supination, pull. Okay, I involve the thumb. Right, so I do a, a, a grip like that. Okay, so it's over top of my thumb, and I twist up, 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 up. Okay, same thing with the left, alright, up, 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 50 times, so that's 150 reps now, then uh, I'll switch to push, alright, so exact opposite of the post, okay, this time I'm going straight, straight down, 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 Again, it's, it's in line, okay, my wrist is straight, and uh, the running edge is under my knuckle, okay, right there. Alright, so that's straight down, 50, 50. Then, uh, with supination, okay, twist in, twist in, twist in. Twist in and switch to the left. Same thing. 50. 
Next one, around the thumb, okay? And pushing down and with twist. For 50 and 50. Okay, so I've done 150 up varieties, 150 down varieties, and now I'm just going to finish off with 50, uh, 50 kickback. Okay, right over top of the back. Okay, 50. And then with the left. And then just easy, uh, easy cut, right? Just 50 and 50. Easy day. Throw another water bottle in, or another rock, or two and a half pounds or whatever. Do it again. Total workout about 25 minutes, 30 minutes, something like that. Uh, and all you should do is just get a flush. Okay. All you should do is just increase blood flow. No extra trauma. No tax in your strength. All it is is just to promote healing and uh, you know remind your body where your damage is so that it can get in there and heal it more. Uh, another another real easy one. Again, uh, this exercise is not that specific for arm wrestling. I never really say that grip is a big part of arm wrestling, but I just think that uh, that grip is a very easy exercise to do and it's gonna stimulate blood flow in the whole area, which is good, which is what I'm trying to do. Uh, just standard old dumbbell, okay? And just one arm uh, shrug with a lot of grip movement, okay? And again, you know, 50 reps or so. 50 reps, okay, so letting the weight roll down and roll it up. Switch hand, okay? Same thing, all right? All right, about 50 reps. And uh, nice and controlled, nothing crazy. Throw another five pounds on there, just keep on going up until you know, you're at a weight where you actually, you know, you're starting to use your muscle and you're like, okay, this is fine. Um, at the end of it all, good flush. Do that for three or four days and you're just going to be all healed up and you're going to be ready for the next practice. So this is just another way to train, to get ready, to crush people. More power, more healing, getting ready to get back on the table to, uh, to do the real work. Hi, hookers. <laughs>